Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. Often referred to as the father of journalism in Mississippi, newspaper publisher Andrew Marshock was born on this day, February 4, 1767, in New York. According to his own account, Marshock introduced the first printing press in the Mississippi Territory in the late 18th century at Fort Hill, north of Vicksburg, and published the first book in the state in 1799. On July 26, 1802, Marshock founded the Mississippi Herald, which he published for six years. Eventually, the printer moved to nearby Washington, Mississippi, where he published the Washington Republican. For the remaining 36 years of his life, Marshock lived in Natchez and Washington, publishing various books, pamphlets, and newspapers. In 1828, he became interested in the case of Ibrahima, the Prince of Slaves, and successfully petitioned Secretary of State Henry Clay to help return the enslaved man to Africa. Marshock supported the former slaves' tour through the northern United States to raise funds to liberate his children. Marshock died in Natchez on August 8, 1838, and is buried in the Natchez City Cemetery. Hi, I'm Kevin Cooper. I'm the publisher of the Natchez Democrat, and this has been your Natchez History Minute.